Hello guys, LuckyStroy551 here. Welcome or welcome back to my LP of Pikmin 2. In the last episode, we got a brand new Pikmin type, Purple Pikmin. And, and we found a new area, and we are in said area. This is the Awakening Wood. Good morning! It should please you to know that Purple Pikmin are lodged in my hole. The confines of my interior seem to suit them perfectly, though they do occasionally tickle me. Sending the stand in the ring of light and call them out. We won't need to do that today, actually, so we're gonna leave them be. Yes, we cannot actually salvage purple Pikmin off of um, corpses that we may need, so all we need, all we can do right now is um, further propagate our red Pikmin species. So let's get all 48 of you out. So let's do that, shall we? Yes, this is the Awakening Wood. This is a brand new area. And as you notice, this place looks kind of different from the Valley of Repose. A cool thing that Pikmin 2 did is that it separated all of its places by season. So, yes, you might wonder why this place looks kind of springy. That's the reason. Every single place is separated by season, so every single place has a different look. Which is kind of cool. So, we're gonna further propagate our species, so let's do that. By killing red bulb orbs, which caused me so, many stri so much strife in my last LP. Oh my goodness, you have absolutely no idea unless you watched it. Okay. Propagating is fun. Anyway, <laughs> let's see what we can do to get more of you. Wait, this thing pushing me back? Yeah, bugs, okay. That makes a total sense. I should not get pushed back by bugs because bugs can't push me. I'm above them in every way possible. Okay. Besides that. Oh my goodness, we have so many Pikmin now, don't we? I should have probably left Louie to help them propagate. Pull them out. Whatever works. Alright. Now that that's done, I don't know why no one has picked you up yet. So we'll do that. Actually, I will split you guys off really quick. And I'll have Olimar stay here and help you further propagate the species. Oh my goodness. Look at all of you! All of you beautiful Pikmin. Oh my goodness. We'd have an army of 66 in a matter of, like, minutes. Oh my goodness. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> it's amazing to me. Okay. I'm gonna give you all to Louie, and then you can have your fun with that big red bulb over there. So, Louie, take care of things, will you? Thank you very much, sweetheart. We're gonna take care of this big old red bulb over right here. So, let's do that, shall we? But let's get the right angle first. And charge! Finally. Alright, so we're gonna get plenty of stuff off this big guy. And why did I aim you all all the way over there? My aim is terrible. Okay. Let's fix that. Alright. And look right there, I think I see a strawberry. Let's pick it up, shall we? Alright, that's plenty of you all on one fruit. Fantastic. All right, let's see what's over here. Berries. Well, maybe we can get some berries. Let's see here. All right, guys, please come here. Yeah, a, f a finicky thing with the pigment is that you aim it. If you aim them incorrectly and you need to get them away, you might actually, if you if you blow a little too hard, you might actually get the pigment away from their work, which is actually quite frustrating. So, a bunch of berries are falling down. Let's get these guys, shall we? And we got the strawberry. Let's see what the strawberry is called, shall we? We get 170 pufflers for one fruit. This is called the sunseed berry. Kind of cute little name. All right. And we have all, all ready to recover 10% of the debt. Isn't that just fantastic? Perhaps the 
ship will have something to say about the fruit. And look at that, it already does. Wow, look at how round it is. Astounding, this is red berry that contains ultra spicy essence. It doesn't appear to have any monetary value, but I shall research potential uses for it. Bring me another specimen. Already on your way, Captain. Alrighty. Let's break down this black gate. Alright. I don't have Louie take care of the regular people that are gonna come back. Hopefully they will. Hopefully maybe they won't. Who knows? Let's pluck the rest of these guys. No, all right. Oh my goodness, another message from the ship. What is it this time? Now it's kind of jello-y. <laughs> all right. Captain Olimar, my research on the red berries you discovered has yielded a powerful potion. Behold the ultra spicy spray. Although it is untested, I believe it will have spectacular results. Spray it on your pigment by pressing two. When necessary, I can produce one bottle of, sp bottle of spray from ten berries. Okay, so yes, the red berries will give you the ultra spicy essence. And so we need to harvest as many berries as we can. But we can't do that right now because we have pigment to pluck. So yes, now we have an upstanding army of 80 pigment. Isn't that fantastic? Oh my goodness, look at all of you! Alright, let's have some of you harvest more, because this is Harvest Moon, I don't know why I made that really weird reference. That was not even funny. Okay, let's see if I can get more berries. And let's have the rest of you work on that. Alright guys, a little help would be nice, thank you. Not sure what you're all doing over there, but you could help carry these back. That'd be great. Alright, fantastic. So yes, one bottle of spray will come from ten berries, so it does take a little bit of harvesting to get them all. Alright, we'll have the rest of you work on this gate. I don't know how the rest of you ended up over there. But, we'll have Louie here split off, and we'll have Olimar take care of the regular ones that won't be coming back. So, let's have Louie take care of the rest of them that just broke down that gate. Oh, maybe it's not entirely broken yet. Maybe three others will help break down the process. Oh my goodness, look at you go! You did it, you rascals! Alright, what's this? Oh, it's an enemy, okay. Let's take care of it. Alright, that was very easy. But still, let's take its corpse back, because it might help. Alright, that's plenty of you. Let's see here. Hmm, maybe we can break this down. 200! Well, I don't think we can do that right now. Um, let's see what's over here. Whoa! I, okay, I forgot about this. Oh my goodness, this guy. This dude. Don't even get me started on this guy. Oh my goodness. Yes, this enemy is not one of my favorites. Oh man. Frankly, this thing gives me the heebie-jeebies, but still, that's just me. I don't know why I went into full screen there, but oh well! Alright. Let's have Olimar take back what is rightfully his. Fantastic. Let's see if there's something over here. What do you know? A cave. Biological 
Visual sensors are reacting violently. The readings are ominous. A beast of unknown power looks in the depths. A large Pikmin group would be reassuring. My sound sensors are picking up hostile roars of many beasts. Expect dangerous encounters. Sensors are also showing extreme heat pockets. You may need flame resistant Pikmin. But my records indicate no such data. Are my records incomplete? Well, this looks charming. It's called the Hole of Beasts, but I can't enter in there right now. So maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should gather the rest of you and help have them help me out here. So let's do that, shall we? Elmer, you need to you need to do some picking. So please do that. Oh my goodness, a large Pikmin group would be reassuring. Yes, that would be reassuring. Oh my goodness. Okay. So maybe next episode we'll go into the whole of these because we're already at 11 minutes. Oh my. F-A-O my Schwartz. Alright. Is that Pikmin over there? What are you doing over there? No, that's soil. What am I mistaking soil for? I have absolutely no idea. Okay. Oh my goodness, you all are amazing! Oh wow! Alright, another tutorial. Olimar, we have a problem. The onion has ceased ejecting seeds. Is, is it malfunctioning? Interesting, it seems the number of life forms within the onion has increased. Didn't you note that, uh, didn't... Didn't you know that more than 100 Pikmin will venture onto, onto the planet at once? But currently observing only 95, but I'm currently only observing 95 on the surface. Could there be wild Pikmin somewhere? Yeah, that is strange. I think I've lost some. Maybe I have. Who knows? But I've got some picking to do. So, let's get the rest of you and help Louie on his expedition into the Hole of Beasts. What a weird name. It's not necessarily weird, it's just foreboding. Okay, there you are. Come with me. Follow me, set me free, trust me, and you'll escape from the city. Okay, we're missing four. I don't know how we're missing four, but we're missing four. Let's see here. Maybe I left them back in the cave. Who knows? Where have they gone? How are you all the way over there, little buddy? Hang on. Okay, I'm gonna get you, and then, okay. Hang on, this, this is kind of odd. Okay, where am I? Okay, hmm. I did not expect this, ladies and gentlemen. I'm terribly sorry. Okay, let's go back to the onion. Whoa! Hey there, little buddies. What are you doing? Alright. Strange things are happening. Alright, well, let's... Okay, I think we found all our Pikmin. So... I believe we will have to enter into the this cave known as hang on as I can get you guys fantastic this cave we will enter this cave in the next episode so I will see you guys later